This is Caillou Ninja News, or CNN for short, with your host, Caillou Ninja. Oh, hey, sorry, didn't see you there. Okay, welcome to Caillou Ninja News, and this is for CNN for short. And don't forget, I am your host, Caillou Ninja, and I'm broadcasting my show at Caillou Ninja News Industries, aka the basement. Okay, let's cut to the cheese. Okay, guys, I got something to tell you. This is gonna be a way different kind of news episode. Okay, and bad things are happening in America. Mom and I talked about it. Yeah, it's a thing. This is a thing we're gonna talk about. It's actually a the thing that we're gonna talk about in this in this week's episode. Okay, it's called racism. Okay, my mom found this book online. It's called a kids book about racism by Janelle Memory. And kids, if you want to get a book like the book like this, you, me, mom is going to set a link so you can buy that book online too. Okay? Okay, let's read this book. This is a book about racism. For reals. And yes, it's really for kids. It's a good book to read with a grown up because you have lots to talk about afterward. If it's just you, keep reading. The book won't bite. Now to introduce myself, my name is Janelle. And my skin color looks like this. If you are colorblind, this is a color for you. My dad is black and my mom is white, which makes me mixed. Or biracial, African American, black, or person of color. I'm proud who I am and the color of my skin. But because of my skin color, people aren't always nice to me. Sometimes they call me names, but other times it's worse. The person doing it might not even realize it hurts me a lot. You see, some people believe that having different color skin means you aren't as good as others. That's called racism. What is racism? Racism means you hate someone, exclude them, or treat them badly because their race of colors of their skin, and it happens all the time. Racism over there, racism over there, racism all over the world. So, yeah, well, it, but but here's the thing: not just in big ways. But sometimes it shows up in small ways, like they're all almost invisible to us. Like a, a look, a comment, a question, a thought, a joke, a word, or a belief. Racism is one of the worst kinds of mean someone can be. But because racism thinks being different is bad. But Wait, being different is good. Like wee 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 wee. Almost there, I promise, kids. Wee 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 wee. A zillion times wee wee. Good. One thousand percent good. Because being different means we have so much more to offer each other. Things like help, ideas, strengths. Skills, creativity, right? Respect, community, love, knowledge, experience, um, wisdom, and and other kinds of stuff like that. Okay, that whole being different thing makes us better, much better. So if you see someone being treated badly, made fun of, excluded from playing, or looked down on because of their skin color, that's racism. No. I have autism, that makes me different. My friends have different skin color, that makes them different. We're all different. 
But that doesn't mean that we are West. It's up to us to change the future and end racism by being kind to other people's differences. We need to do that. So see you in the next episode this Friday. This is the end of the show, everybody, and don't forget to subscribe to youtube.com slash c slash slash Ninja. Bye-bye now, and see you in the next week's episode.